If you've ever seen those videos of Amazon package thieves getting scared off by homeowners, you've likely seen the product of a video doorbell. Video doorbells offer security, peace of mind, and the opportunity to keep eyes over your household, its comings, goings, and any deliveries. I'm Erin from TechGadgetsCanada.com, and I recently had the opportunity to review the Toucan Video Doorbell at my home. I'm going to tell you what I learned about the experience. By the way, if you end up liking this video and finding it helpful, please hit that like button and give me a sub because it does help me keep making more videos that I hope everyone out there can watch, enjoy, and learn from. Toucan Wireless Video Doorbell is an app-connected, remote, wireless, and Wi-Fi connected doorbell setup with an included chime. The battery-powered chime is designed to be an audible alert so you can hear that someone's at your door even if your phone isn't handy. This doorbell is quite compact compared to some others and it has HD resolution plus a 180 degree field of view so you can see all around your door and it runs on a built-in rechargeable battery. The setup process for this doorbell was super quick and the app will walk you through it. I was ready to go in just a couple of minutes. Essentially, you'll get the app, sign into or sign up for an account, connect to your home's Wi-Fi network and that's about it. When someone rings the doorbell or if motion is detected even without a ring, the Toucan doorbell will instantly notify you on your smartphone that someone is there. With the two-way talk function, you can see and speak to that person from anywhere, your home office or even across the country. No one ever needs to know that you're not home. Plus, with cloud recording, you can access videos of every visit as well. Well, kind of. During my testing, I noticed a bit of weirdness with the app. The Toucan app doesn't actually record the ring as an instance of video, but it does record starting with the first motion that's captured at the door. It makes it a bit weird to find and review those interactions. You need to open up the motion alert just prior to the ring in order to see that video. When it comes to the quality of those videos, the HD video is good quality. It's easy to identify folks that come to the door or to talk to them too. With the recorded motion alerts, you can easily look back at people approaching your door even if they don't end up ringing the bell. When it comes to evening and nighttime, the night vision video means you can see everyone at your door quite well. In order to review your videos, you're going to need one of Toucan's cloud recording plans. Toucan's free plan lets you look at videos made only within the last 24 hours. The pro plan, which costs about $3 US per month, gives you seven days worth of cloud storage and access. And the elite plan lets you access your videos for up to 90 days. Now, while this kind of ticks some people off, a paid cloud recording plan is now pretty much standard with most Wi-Fi camera brands. I will also say for the most part, I'm only really ever looking at videos that are a day or two old, but that's just me. So you'll definitely want to consider how and what you're going to use this camera for. A nice feature of this doorbell is the included chime. Now other doorbells make you pay extra for an audible chime, but here it is part of the package. With the Toucan chime you can have six different choices for what your doorbell will sound like. While the process for changing the sound is actually done on the chime itself and not inside the app, which I find a bit weird, you can adjust it easily enough. Another difference in this chime over some others is that it's battery powered so you can truly place it anywhere. Other chimes need an AC plug and in my home at least, those are in pretty short supply. Now what about battery life? Toucan tells me the expected battery life depends on how often the camera is used and how much motion is being detected or how much video is being captured. It's estimated to be anywhere from about six weeks to six months and yes that is a pretty wide gamut. My doorbell here has been in place uh, out front of my house for about four weeks now and it still shows as full. For added security there's an audible siren. You do have to turn it on manually inside the app and I will add it's not piercingly loud. Hello, was it? Similarly, you can use the embedded pre-recorded messages to answer your door Please as well. Toucan smart home cameras and doorbells are compatible with your smart home digital assistants like Alexa or Google, in particular ones with a screen like the Amazon Echo Show 8 or the Google Home Hub Max. By enabling the skill in the Alexa app or connecting Toucan to your Google Home, you can ask your assistant to show me the backyard and you should get a live feed of your video camera. Show me the parrot doorbell. For me, this feature worked intermittently and was hit or miss. Hmm, the camera isn't responding. 
Overall, this is a great little video doorbell. It's compact, it's easy to set up, and it works just as advertised. If I have any complaints about this device, it's that using the app to review footage for me wasn't intuitive. If you are reviewing footage from a specific day, for example, and you click on one of the events in the timeline, when you're done, the app boots you back to the main calendar list of recordings, forcing you to then go back, reselect your date again, and then go back and search for the video you're trying to locate. It is pretty tedious and overly time consuming. Also, the videos do take some time to load, so it might look like you have only a few interactions on any given day, but if you pull the list down to refresh it, more videos are gonna pop up. Now, I trust this will be an easy fix for Toucan in a future app update. Overall though, I think you're getting good value for your home security dollar with the Toucan wireless video doorbell, and I can definitely recommend it for your home security needs. It sells for about 129 Canadian dollars, and you can get it from places like Best Buy or Amazon. If you want to read more about it, head over to techgadgetscanada.com where I have posted a full blog. You can ask me any questions you have about this video doorbell device either there on the blog or, as always, here on the YouTube channel. I'm Erin, thanks so much for watching. Until the next video, you can catch me on either Twitter or Instagram. I'm at ErinLYYC. You can also always find me at facebook.com slash techgadgetscanada.